Hello everyone and welcome to Warrior Friday. I'm really excited because I actually got to have a massage this morning and I haven't had one for three months. So it's a beautiful day. If you're not doing some self-care, try it out. It's wonderful. Um, today is Warrior Friday and we have a card from the Earth Warriors Oracle deck. And it is a beautiful card. It is card number 44, and 44 is a master number. It's very powerful. Um, angels are watching over us. But not only angels, we have white buffalo woman watching over us today. Now, I don't know if you have felt the shift this week, but wow, we've had a huge shift. Monday and Tuesday were very chaotic days. Um, yeah, Wednesday was too. It's just everything has seemed a little different this week. And I'm not talking about politically or anything like that. I'm talking about just life in general. You might have noticed that there was some kind of a shift. And I think the fact that we get white buffalo woman today is another indication of that shift. So um, underneath the white buffalo woman, it says, hopeful heart, see her sign. So I'm going to read from the book about white buffalo woman. Have hope, for you are pure of heart. And White Buffalo Woman appears as the divine sign of rebirth and harmony. She is the way shower who lives as one with Great Spirit. She teaches the practices that will free us and empower us all. She heralds the birth of the divine upon a new earth. You are held in her heart and you will recognize her beautiful grace of spirit as your own. Wow, that is beautiful and powerful. Um, I'm going to read about the healing process that goes with this card. Hmm. I'm going to read the paragraph before that. For those of us that love the light and labor with great passion and perseverance, we need legitimate signs of hope to help us keep the faith in our progress and trust in the value of our contribution. For the evidence of good works is not always seen straight away. Isn't that the truth? Patience. We always have to have patience. It's, it's one of my lessons that I have to learn in this lifetime. That the spiritual worlds love us enough to send us saviors is a testament to just how closely we are held and known in the divine heart. These divine beings help us when we are struggling to make the transition into the next stage of our spiritual evolution individually and collectively. Savior beings are our spiritual midwives, the birthing mothers and protective fathers who are guiding the human collective into spiritual maturity. White Buffalo Woman brings you the saving grace to progress spiritually and to know in your heart and soul that you shall see the sacred restored to its rightful place and spiritual harmony between heaven and earth. Oh, it goes right here. So with one hand on your heart, say aloud, and you can just listen to me say it if you like. Such is your love, great spirit, that our every human need is anticipated. And in times when we have lost our way, you send us a savior, one who loves us with such passion and purity that they are moved to action on our behalf. May we open our hearts to such saving grace and truly embrace your ways, great spirit, bringing the harmony of heaven to earth. Through my own free will, and divine grace, so be it. If there are people, including yourself, who need a blessing of hope, 
healing, and renewal. You can call for special assistance now by saying, I call for special assistance of divine dispensation through unconditional love, divine redemption, and mercy for myself or the names of other people. Then simply place your hands in prayer at your heart and bow your head. If you can, imagine a powerful, shining white buffalo within your heart, radiant and kind and rare, a sign of true hope, renewal, and divine miracles of healing. Allow yourself to feel touched by the radiance, the otherworldly grace and beauty of this creature in your heart. He will fade away softly, spreading his presence out as light to all those beings on your list. Or if you do not stay to list, he will spread his light to the world as a whole. Rest for a moment in the bliss of this blessing. It gave me goosebumps while I was reading it. That's just beautiful. So may you have a blessed Warrior Friday. All my beautiful soul family, I send you love, light, peace, joy, happiness, success, and divine health.